This is the Meg Chi automatic wireless charger. You'll see it holds my phone pretty well there. If I kind of touch it, opens, no, let go. There it goes. And that's even without it plugged in. So that's just with the battery power that's there. I have owned a few different wireless charging devices from Meg Chi have a magnetic mount on the back of my phone that has uh, magnets on it that attaches to a vent mount that I already have in my car. But this is a mount if you have a case on your phone, if you don't want to stick something to the back of your phone. Now this does come with a vent mount. I also have a suction cup mount from a different MagChi charger uh, that I could use if I wanted to suction this to the window. First off, I do really like the way it's packaged. There's the instruction manual, and everything kind of sits nicely lodged into the back there. It has a little switch on it, and you push that and it collapses. It also comes with a micro USB cable and a little car charger. This isn't branded Mag Chi like their other devices. This is branded Geno Smart. There's three little buttons on this device. There's there's one here that little cradle there that your phone could sit in, and there's this button on the side that when you push it makes the jaws open. And there's this other button down here, and this this is a button that I wish my wireless car charger had. This turns off the charging, the wireless charging. Now, why do I say I wish it had that? Because my current vent mount that I do have, the magnetic vent mount that I have for this, that magnetic charging creates a little bit of heat because it is uh, magnetic charging. And if I have the heater on in my car, that creates more heat. And sometimes my phone will start getting a little bit of glitchiness there from the charging just because it's getting too hot. So it's nice to have the ability to turn off the wireless charging if your phone is just getting too hot. I'll plug this in here so you can kind of see how this works. It's already asking for a phone. One of the really cool things about this is when it it's unplugged, it still has the ability to release your phone. Because maybe you have a car that doesn't leave power going through the USB outlet or through your cigarette lighter adapter outlet once you shut off your car. This makes it so there's going to be a little charge in there so you won't have to struggle with it to get your phone out or you won't have to take your phone out before you turn off your car. I like this adjustable bottom holder because unlike some of the clamps, this should make sure that your phone's gonna sit right there. Now right now this is an opening. Oh, there it goes. And now it's closed. And there it goes, it's charging. I would assume that this wouldn't open accidentally. So this is a really solid hold. I like it. I think in the car it's gonna be good. I like the fact that it does have this little cradle so it doesn't fall off. I like the fact that it's wireless charging. That's really nice. And a bonus is that it remains charged after it loses power, which is great. Um, again, one of the things that I'm really, really impressed with this is it does have a button to turn on and off the wireless charging capability, which I just don't see on many wireless chargers. So it comes with everything you need to get started. Plug. USB cable and the vent mount as well and you just put it right on there and put it into your vent and there you go there's the Meg Chi automatic wireless charger